Responders are urging visitors at Sand Hollow Reservoir to come be, uh, better prepared and use caution. Several more visitors have been injured in ATV and boater accidents just this week. ABC4's Katie Corrales reports tonight from Hurricane. Sand Hollow Reservoir is a top tourist destination in southern Utah. And so far this summer, park officials say they've responded to more than 50 distressed calls, with more than a dozen coming from those in serious danger. We want people when they come out here to have a good time. And with that many people, it's everyone being safe together. A man in his 70s was tubing Tuesday afternoon when the boat came to a stop and the propeller cut his knee. And a teenage boy was taken to the hospital with serious hand injuries Wednesday night after his ATV rolled over when he turned too quickly. Park officials say the majority of these calls are coming from people from out of state who have come to the park for the first time and may be inexperienced with the vehicles and terrain. In the last month, rangers have responded to seven ATV accidents. They say most of them are caused by people turning too quickly or going too fast, especially given the heat. People turn their tires and instead of coasting, the machine comes to an abrupt stop. Recent weather has also been dangerous for boaters, with storms causing them to crash or hit submerged rocks. Several boaters say they frequently see others putting themselves in danger. I never see people wearing life jackets on the boats, um, and I have seen people like fall out. Park officials say that on any given weekend, they have three rangers patrolling on the water from sunrise to sunset. But visitors say more oversight may be necessary. In Hurricane, Katie Corrales, ABC4 News.